Welcome back. This is Barry with Cryptics ABC for All. This is tutorial 7C and this is about lateral clues or puns, that is, puns, jokes, whatever you like to call them. Lateral clues. Again, the whole clue is the key, but it requires lateral, which is sideways thinking. It's, it's sort of a tongue-in-cheek clue. It's humorous. It's a pun. That's what it's about. Okay, a little bit of a, a switch, isn't it? Here we go. A pun's usually put as a question to let you know that it is tongue-in-cheek. You think, oh, that's not quite true. You say you put a question mark after it. Just a joke. You get the idea there? It will often finish with a question mark, and that's your flag. Remember, when a clue has no other flag, look for a charade, double key, and lit, or a pun. Right. Flag is a question mark. Now, by the way, some puns do not have a question mark as a flag. And another point, some question marks will appear in clues, and they don't flag a pun. The, the compiler is quite at liberty to set a, 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 a clue with a question mark, with a normal question mark, for a normal question. So, a rare pun may contain a letter play like we saw in the last one, okay? Right, here's the first example. Do angry people live in this country? Question mark. Could be a pun. Just looking at it, there's no other key, no other flag there. We think it's going to be a pun. Okay, so the whole thing is the key. Righto. Now you have to think of a synonym for that. Do angry people live in this country? It's a question mark. Look, it's a pun. Don't forget, you can say it with a raised voice, uh, raised inflection at the end. Do angry people live in this country? That's what it's supposed to mean. It's a question. It's a pun. Okay? Can you think of one? You have a, I'll pause it and try. Okay, did you come up with one? Of course, it must be to do with the name of the country. Suggested angry people live there. And did you get it? It is Ireland. Of course, Ireland. Suggesting it's a land of ire. Okay, next one. A leg puller relaxed. Okay. Six paces, a two and a four. Righto, over to you. Think of a synonym for a leg puller relaxed. Is this a, is this this is a question mark? Of course, a leg puller relaxed. Is that what it means? A leg puller puller relaxed. Okay, did you get it? Right, a synonym for that: a leg puller relaxed is a tease. <laughs> Why? Because a leg puller is a tease. Now, if you're relaxed, you're at ease. You get it? So when you see a tease or a tease, you see two words, at ease, you could say, is this a leg puller relaxed? It's a joke, of course. Okay, so the whole thing was the key. All right, next one. Clockwork hearts. Again, a statement's made and you say, is a pun? Huh, are these clockwork hearts? Is, it, is this mean, does, these, does this mean clockwork hearts? That's the, that's the idea, that's the way you say it. All right, the whole thing is a clue, is a key. Your turn, pause it, try it. Okay, did you come up with it? Okay. When you see the word, is she got it? When you see the word, tickers. You can say, are these clockwork hearts? Of course, they're not, are they? But that's it. That's the pun. Next one. Service centre. You're saying, is this a service centre? Right? whole thing is the, is the key. It's a pun. A lateral clue. Okay, pause it, see if you can come up with it. 
Okay, back again. Is this a server center? Answer. Yes, it is. It's a church. Did you get it? Yes, a church is a service centre because you go there for a service. Not of your car, but a personal, soul service. Okay, next one. Prison's bacon and eggs, cooked Asian style. Is that what this is? When you see this tape and you say, does this, does this mean prison's bacon and eggs cooked Asian style? Okay, have a go yourself, see what you can come up with. Okay, bit of fun, wasn't it? Yeah, two words, four and three, and the answer is stir fry. Why is it stir fry? Because a prison is a stir. And doing eggs, bacon eggs, you fry them, so it's a stir fry. <laughs> you, get the, you get the picture. Okay, that's how it works. Now, don't forget to subscribe, please, if you like it. And now I do exercises 7.1 to 7.3. And then after that, you're ready for the big ones, the puzzles, the complete puzzles, which we'll do then. Okay, good on you. Thanks for watching.